Mi Y12 EU version is now available for Redmi Y2. So going to our about phone section, here as you can see the version is Mi Y12 12.0.4. Going to all specs, here as you can see the device name is Redmi Y2 and Android version is 9. Security patch is July and the kernel version is 3.18. Going back. Now speaking about all the basic functionalities like calling mobile data bluetooth everything is working fine. Trying and connecting a call. As you can see the call just connected. Now going to portable hotspot. Portable hotspot on this ROM is working fine. Now going back. Going to connection and sharing. Even USB Thettering can be used when you are connecting it to a PC. Now going to display. You get general dark mode and you get to change system font weight. Going back. Going to battery. Speaking about the battery performance of this ROM, battery backup on this ROM is quite average as expected by MIUI. And speaking about performance, it's actually blasting fast and the animations are fluid. Now going back. The launcher here is also upgraded and you get a smoother launcher. Gaming on this ROM is not good as MIUI does not optimize its ROM for gaming. Now going back to settings. Going to lock screen. Here you get the option to wake screen when no fingerprint have been enrolled. Scrolling down. You also get the option to allow access power menu while the device is locked. If you turn it off. Now as you can see it does not show up the power menu. Now going back, now scrolling down you get wallpaper carousel and you also get side panel shortcuts. You can also launch camera by double tapping the lock uh, power button and going back, going to sound and vibration, here you get all the general stuff that you get in MIUI 12. For seeing all the features related to MIUI 12, you can check out the i button that I have linked. Now scrolling down. Going to passwords and security, here you get face unlock, unlock with a bluetooth device, fingerprint or a general password. Going back, now the main thing, going to security app. If you agree and go in, going to cleaner, here as you can see, in definitions, you only get clean master. So it's up to you whether you want to install this ROM or not. But I have to say, according to a MIUI ROM, performance is really good but gaming is not good. For gaming, you can go and try ancient OS or any Corvus OS like stuff from. So if you want to install this ROM on your device, make sure you download a file that I link in the description. Once you have downloaded it, reboot to recovery. Now going to wipe, wipe Talvik, cache, system and data. Now go back. Now browse the file that you downloaded. The file name should be xiaomi.eu and hms2 version 12.0.4 and it should look something like this. So once you have found the file, flash it and reboot. You will be rebooted into your MIUI 12. So if you enjoyed the video, do like, share and subscribe for more updates.